the area that we're scanning, which will then give both of us a clear picture of what we're seeing inside the body. So the clinician in the ED is then better informed of the patient that I am seeing and can then support my clinical assessment with a second, more advanced opinion. What we're trying to do here is to showcase what this technology starts to enable us to do. We're working with our partners, Universities Hospital Birmingham and, and also BT, and we've brought together a fantastic demonstration of what we can do with 5G and ultrasound. So it allows the paramedic to do the scan, but it allows an ED consultant or a consultant radiologist uh, to look at those scans in real time and speak back to the paramedic asking and telling him what to do. This cannot be done over existing 3G or 4G networks. It requires a very high bandwidth and very low latency in order to get these signals in real time so a diagnosis can be made. The ability to make the appropriate diagnosis at the patient rather than having to bring the patient into the hospital to make that diagnosis is key. And at BT, one of the things we think is really important about innovation, and we spend a lot of money on R&D, we're the third biggest investor in R&D in the UK, but the thing we've learned over many years is that innovation happens best when you collaborate. We really believe in collaborative innovation, and this is a great example of collaboration. It allows me as a clinician to make a lot better decisions, um, it gives more weight to my decisions that I'm making, which ultimately improves patient outcomes. Alongside West Midlands 5G and obviously BT and EE, we have, uh, we've already seen how the implementation of the emergency services network has improved our communications, not just within the ambulance service, but also within the emergency services as a whole. I think that will have a dramatic effect. I think it will have an effect on patient safety. We know that getting patients to hospital, to the right hospital, the right time and the right place is key to survival. 